Hold up, let me make sure they had the same denominators, then I'm gonna get right back to the ad. Alright, so any time my right. denominators. Let's look at a mixed number fraction added to another mixed number fraction so we can see how we're going to add fractions with unlike denominators. So we're looking at, mm, let's start with purple. I like purple. Let's go with um, five, right? And let's go with one, four. And we're going to add that to three and two over six. All right, so using our lyrics from Lyrical Math, we're going to knock this out. We're going to knock this out. Anytime my denominator is different, so these are denominators in your fractions. If you have a mixed number fraction, which means you have an integer and then you have a fraction part with it, that's called a mixed number fraction. Say that with me, mixed number fraction. Then you want to look at the fraction part. The top part is called the numerator. The bottom part is called the denominator, right? So here the denominators would be four and six. So listening to the lyrics, anytime my denominator is different. Are they the same or different? They are definitely different. This one's a four. This one's a six. Next in the lyrics, it says, I'm looking for that LCM till I get it. So let's, let's recite that. Anytime my denominator is different, I'm looking for that LCM till I get it. All right? So we want to find what's called the least common multiple. And so right here, we're just going to set up a section right here for our LCM. This stands for least common, least common what? Multiple, least common multiple, all right? L-C-M. So what we're going to do is look at our denominators and we're looking to the answers for the fours. So that's four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24. Notice we're just constantly adding what? Four. Even if you don't have your timetable memorized, you just want to keep adding the same number. Keep adding that denominator to itself. So in this, time, in this case, we have four. We're going to keep adding four until we get to four times nine, which is 36. We're then going to do the same thing for the other denominator, which is six. So we want to do six. Keep adding six. 12. 18, 24, 30, six more, 36, 42, 48, right? What's next? Six more is going to give us 54, 54, all right? And so again, we're going to go all the way up to six times nine, which gives us 54. All right, so now we have that all figured out, right? And so we're looking at it and we're going to say, anytime my denominator is different, I'm looking for that LCM until I get it. LCM is least common multiple. So what is the multiple? These are called the multiples of four. These are the multiples of six. What is the smallest one that they both have? In this case, if you notice, it is what? 12, boom. Anytime my denominator is different, I'm looking for that LCM until I Get it. So LCM of four and what? Six is 12. So we're going to now make our denominators 12 instead of four and six because we can only add fractions if they have the same denominator. So now I'm going to, next to the four, I'm going to make it say 12. Now keep in mind, I'm keeping this big old five right so it's still five in the front but instead of four i'm using 12. and then down here it's still three in the front but instead of six i'm using what 12. all right there we go there we go looking good there we go so with this in mind my next step we want to hear the lyrics and we want to figure this out 